Go ahead. Intro? Yeah. Uh, or have we already introduced her at this point, or am I introducing her now? No, you're introducing her now. Okay. Anna, what's the best title for, for you? Um, marketing director. Okay, great. Uh, bringing in now Anna Miller from, and it is, once again, Anna Miller, right? Spelled Mueller, but, but pronounced Miller? Yes, correct. Yeah, I just My husband to make, would be pleased with that. I thought so. I wanted to make sure. <laughs> Welcoming back to the show, Anna Miller from Minnesota Eye Consultants, marketing director, and also a ho former hockey player and a hockey fan. Uh, you know, Russo and I have a certain perspective uh, from the press box and from working locker rooms. Uh, give, give us the fan perspective, what it's like to be a Wild fan this time of the year. Yeah, well, this is the, the best time of the year to be a Wild fan, especially when they've been on a pretty fun streak and in, in getting into the playoffs. So we're, we're stoked. Um, Super exciting energy from the team. It's they're obviously playing very confident, um, so it's really fun. And have you gone to any games? Not yet. No. Do you plan I to? Mean, this year I have, but certainly none of the the ones most recently. So. So how many foam fingers do you owe, do you own, and how many times have you flipped <laughs> off the opponent? Yeah, I don't. I think I've got a couple of those, you know, wild claw bare hands, but they've probably. Um, deteriorated a bit from, from now, but I've got a Koi Blue jer jersey. We've got lots of paraphernalia, Parisi's t-shirts and all that good stuff. The wild claws really work well as potholders too. Right. Just a little okay. home, home know. tip there. Keep that in mind. Yeah. yeah. Uh, well, tell me about your business. Uh, you, you've told us about it before, but uh, Minnesota Eye Consultants, Minnesota based, uh, specializes in, is it right to say you specialize in LASIK? Well, we certainly do. So it is a, a full ophthalmology practice. Um, subspecialty though. So LASIK is one of the things that we do refractive surgery. Um, and then we also focus on cornea treatment and procedures, glaucoma, um, cataract surgery, oculoplastics, which is like cosmetic surgery of the eyes and face, um, cosmetic or reconstructive, and then dry eye um, as well. So we're heavily involved in research, but it's a multidisciplinary subspecialty practice. Have you talked Russo into the chair yet? Well, we yeah we have to start, we have to close the loop on that one because he, we didn't get any commitments I don't think last time but we're gonna we're gonna work on that for sure. And w what else can you tell me about the business? Uh, what what uh, what's the breadth I guess of uh, services you provide? Yeah, definitely. Um, you know, it's it's difficult to explain sometimes, but when you talk about refractive surgery, most people generally understand that as LASIK alone, but there's actually quite a bit that falls into that category when you think of um, the different types of refractive surgery that you can do. LASIK is just one kind. Um, so depending on what's best for a unique patient, our surgeons will identify based on their eye and uh, um, the outcomes that they want to have, what specific procedure that might be the best fit, whether that be LASIK or PRK or an implantable contact lens. Um, we do premium IOL implants for cataract patients, um, kind of giving patients that are getting the clouding of their lens as they age, um, reduces clarity of vision. Um, there's really neat technology with those implants that allow patients to see several different distance points without the aid of glasses. Um, glaucoma is a very serious disease. Our surgeons work really hard on treating that, um, both with uh, medications and treatments, but also surgical techniques, um, working a lot on cornea disease. Um, keratoconus is a serious problem, and we've got some unique um, new technologies, corneal cross-linking and um, different types of corneal transplants that our partners are very, very involved in. Um, oculoplastics, there's all sorts of brow lids, um, brow lifts, excuse me, um, eyelid lifts, different things that they can do that both improve vision, um, peripheral vision, but also obviously improve the way um, that patients feel about how they look and improve their confidence in their, um, well, we'll edit that part out. So, but it's a, it's a real, there's a huge, a huge breadth of services, but it, it's just, kind of all, all of those specific um, specialty points. I've always talked to athletes about the importance of uh, having very good vision in their business. Have you worked with any athletes? Yeah, absolutely. Um, we are the preferred ophthalmology group, both for the Minnesota Twins and the Minnesota Vikings. Um, certainly work with some of the players from those teams. 
a lot of the coaches, a lot of just patients that are lead very active lifestyles and want to be free um, of their glasses. It's a big inconvenience if you're, um, you know, trying to, to run or be really active and having to, to manage that. So probably one of the number one reasons people choose to move forward with LASIK or refractive surgery is just to get out there and be more active without having to think about taking care of their eyes at the same time. So, And last time you were on with us, uh, Russo and I at the Liffey, you mentioned uh, that your your business is, has a historic uh, landmark. Is that right? Well, yeah. So our physicians um, worked with the FDA to get LASIK approved in the United States way back. Um, when it first came, you know, through. So they, we were the first practice to do LASIK in Minnesota. Um, I mentioned that several of them work on research um, on a regular basis. So we definitely always have access to the latest and greatest technologies, um, treatments, medications, things like that. So our patients are certainly getting the the newest, but also most effective access to really incredible technologies. And what's the best way to, to find Minnesota Eye Consultants? Yep, anybody can um, do, a, do a quick Google search or find us online at www.mni.com, and that's M-N-E-Y-E dot com. Um, probably the easiest way to get a lot of answers to questions they may have. Otherwise, they can call us at 952-888-5800. Great. Thank you, Anna. I'm sure we'll see you at one of the pubs soon. Sounds good. Thanks, guys. That was great, Anna. Very conversational yeah. and, and uh, worked okay. really well. So thank you so much for doing that. That was terrific. We'll get it uh, edited down. We'll send a copy to you as well. Um, probably okay. share that via Google Drive. So I don't know how much you use Google Drive, but we'll um, if you haven't, we'll send you uh, an invite on that and then make sure you get approved and you can take a listen to it as well. Okay. Okay. Well, I will count on you guys making that sound better than what I feel like it sounded no, like. No, it was. So I appreciate it. And Google, we Google got a lot of really good content out there, and I thought it was a good give and okay. take. So. Perfect. Well, thank and we'll you do so this again next so month, just so you know. Yeah. No, no problem. We'll, we'll do it again we'll next month, just to keep it fresh. Okay. Okay. Take thanks, care. Hey, thanks, Anna. Yep. Bye. Yep.